good to see so many people come out this evening. And a few of the other candidates have said, David, you're wearing a suit tonight. Well, usually I don't. I say I wear suits to weddings, funerals, and when I'm your congressman. But the last time I was out in Beaver Creek soliciting money for my campaign, after I was driving away, the Beaver Creek police pulled me off over. So I figure it might be better to be wearing a suit today. The reason I was in Beaver Creek was because Mike Turner comes out here to Research Boulevard with a company called the Green Tree Group, and he solicits large checks. He got $18,000 last time. That is the problem with the United States today. Money and politics. Until we take the money out of politics, we will forever be running up a debt because the politicians that we're electing, the people in Congress, they spend one year of their two-year term fundraising funds. They spend the other year paying back the people that have bought their position. We have to either fund our elections publicly or we have to put up a line so that there's no more of this, you paid me, do this for me. Now, that being said, the second problem we have in this country is we have a lot of unemployed Americans or underemployed Americans. And I don't care what the job numbers are saying, we don't need any more baristas. We need real jobs in this country. We bailed out the banks, we bailed out a lot of people, and we didn't put any controls or restrictions on them. We didn't ask for the $20 million, $60 million, $100 million salaries back. We didn't put any of those people in prison for running their companies into the ground and requiring that the American taxpayers bail them out. It's time that the federal government, the largest purchaser of goods and services, says, enough's enough. We're not going to do business with companies that pay their chief executive officers extravagant salaries while shipping the jobs overseas for short-term financial gains in the Wall Street casino. We can do that. If you say that's on America, I tell you this. The American people deserve better. They deserve well-paying jobs. They don't deserve to see them shipped off to China or wherever the labor is cheapest. 35 to 1 ratio between your average American worker in your company to the head of the, the company. 20 to 1 if you're a nonprofit. This will solve some of our problems with the health care and medical insurance and the medical people. It will also solve our problems in getting people back to work. I am planning on running a campaign without money from political action to pay special interest groups or corporate interests, and I can do it, and I can do it for a tenth of what Congressman Turner will do. And that's why I want you to go to Israeli.com and read, because since 2005, I've been working to represent you. Thank you. It's the same answer I gave you before. As long as we have the best politicians money can buy, they will be bought, and they will reward those who put them there. We need to eliminate this election as auction system that we have. We need to have real accountability of our elected officials where we can actually vote them out when they screw up, because right now we can't. They have unlimited resources, unlimited money. They go in paupers, they come out millionaires. We take the money out of politics and maybe the representatives will start representing them and make sure that our money is well spent. I've heard Mike Turner say over and over, I work for Right Path. No, you work for us. And not only that, but the people at Right Path work for us. And I believe they honestly know how to do things. And if we get rid of the earmarks, we'll be a lot better off. Thank you.